considering Incline Village as a new home, secondary home, or vacation rental? Well, today we're gonna to show you what $6.2 million looks like in Incline Village, so stay tuned. If you're loving these videos, make sure to subscribe down below. Reach out to us. We love helping out families looking in the Incline area. Now let's show you what $6.2 million will get you in Incline Village. All right, let's take a look at what $6.2 million will get you in Incline Village. Let's see here. We got four bedrooms, six baths. That's always nice. 4,930 square feet. And let's see if there are any HOAs. I don't believe there is. And we like that because you know how I feel about HOAs. They absolutely suck. Let's take a look at a nice little view of the um, water right there in the master bedroom. Really big spacious lot. Nice garages there. Cool balconies. Love that. Oh, I love this. I love the beams. Feeling this for sure. Nice fireplace there, which is really nice. Really liking this place. Great view of the water from the living space. Nice open concept kitchen. I think they did a pretty decent job of the wood here, keeping it kind of like not overwhelmingly woody. And this is nice little bar area right here with all the wine that you can have and hang out and make cocktails and sit and watch the water and look at it and have conversations. Love that. Not sure how I feel about this countertop, but this is really nice. I'm not going to say it's not nice. I love the how it kind of all ties in the wood. It's not too overwhelming. A little bit, but not too much. I would maybe change these countertops to something a little bit more neutral, even more neutral without all the speckles in it and stuff like that. But overall, it looks good. Awesome big fridge. Loving the hardwood floors. I like the little trim details on the window. Nice area to hang out and barbecue and grill. Not too spacious, but you can still see the lake, which is nice. I like this. Good modern bathrooms. Probably change out that mirror, but everything else looks pretty good. There's that little staging thing in there. Great little nook here for an office. Nice master. Love the view. It's beautiful. Mm, love that. Yeah, for $6.2 I think I actually quite like this one. Let's go back to the, the decking here. Interesting, but nice nonetheless. Could be slippery in the winter, but I like that. No wood, minus a little fence line here. So this is good. I don't know how I feel about this tile and the countertops, but you could swap those out pretty easily and potentially keep everything. Maybe change those light fixtures, but it looks good. I like it. Ooh, I like the fact that you can take a bath and look out to the water. Very calming. Really nice. I like that a lot. Nice little office be an office or a place where you can bunk the beds here. Another little room here, probably bunk beds there because we have such a big family, but I'm really liking this 6.2 million. I think finally this is like agreeable. I would definitely change out this tile. I don't like this tile. That's horrible. These are quick, easy fixes. Not too hard, but 6 million you're already paying top dollar. So I think this is a little bit better, a little bit more neutral, less busy. It's a workout area. A spa, so two levels, another room with bunks, nice bathroom. This one I think is good. I wouldn't change anything in here. I think this is fine. A nice little entryway with a fountain. I actually like the fountain. Probably make it a little cool. A nice door I like that. Yeah, I think this is worth it. Beautiful view of the lake. Beautiful views. Definitely like this a lot. I would buy this if I had six million. <laughs> looks good let's take a look at the location on the map so this is right as you come in to incline area not too high up which is good um let's see burnt cedars right here so you can see it's not very far at all it's a really good location good close walking um to the beach and area i think this is definitely a winner so think it's worth it? Let us know in the comments down below. And if you want to know more about living in the Incline Village area, we got you covered here. So just reach out to us below. All the information should be popping up. And until the next video, we hope you enjoyed and we'll see you then. Take care, bye guys.